What's up, everybody? It is my favorite time of the year, my favorite season. Cue the music, summer, summer, summer time. And I am so excited to share with you my favorite products that'll keep you glowing, dewy, and absolutely sun-kissed for the summer. You ready? Check it out. All the products that I'm about to mention can actually be found listed below in the description box so that you two can get your hands on them. All right, here we go. We're gonna start with hair. Now, as you can see, you may have noticed a little change happening. I got so much great feedback from my new Bob, my new blonde Bob that I'm actually calling Bob. Bob the Bob. With that being said, I felt like I was really disappointing you guys when I had to announce that I had not cut my real hair and that I didn't bleach my real hair to make it blonde, but that this right here, my beautiful people, is a fabulous masterpiece by the one and only Red. <laughs> it is a wig. I know, shocker. Blended perfectly, yes, these are my real baby hairs. Now, a lot of you are probably wondering, well, like, why is she wearing a wig? So on the reel, we put so much heat to my hair, and normally I spend my summers going heat-free, uh, because it's healthier for my hair and this year I took that to a whole other level and my hair has grown so much Honestly, my real hair is like probably down to here might be longer than that and it's super healthy And I'm trying to get my curls back So this summer some of my favorite products are going to be heat protectors and pretty much stuff that I can wear my natural curly hair with So you'll be seeing a lot more of that this summer one of my favorite products right now is in commons magic mist so the lady that actually colors my hair that does a few highlights is Nikki, and she's at a salon called 901 here in LA, and they do amazing color, they do everybody. Anyway, this is their product, and what I love about it is it's a universal elixir. It protects your hair from heat, which can also be like sun damage. Uh, it strengthens your hair, hydrates it, and for me, I use it as a refresher for if I'm doing like slick ups, like you know what, you guys have already seen my bun video. Bun hair for summertime hair but this actually refreshes my curls. So in the morning, I'll just like use that all around. And underneath this, we actually just have my hair laid down. We also use it for that. But it's just great for hydrating your hair and keeping it healthy and again, protecting it from the heat. This next product is a product that Ray has a love-hate relationship with, Unite U Oil. This is an argon oil. This deserves a whole video to itself because I swear by it, I swear that it's the reason why my hair has grown so long and that it's super healthy. Now the reason why we have a love-hate relationship with it is because I use this way too much. I arrive at work and Ray is like, why is your hair a greasy mess? What am I supposed to do with this? I love this Unite Oil, it's my favorite. I put it on my hair every single day. Like literally I will remove this wig and just go for it. I do my edges, I make sure that I cover like my baby hairs, especially because even like a wig can sometimes pull on your hair on the sides. I make sure that I moisturize this into my temples and the entire summer long, you will be seeing me with my hair curly, with Unite Oil, and definitely with my In Common Magic Mist. Now, if I didn't want my hair to look that oily, then the key is, hello, dry shampoo. Because another key to making your hair really strong and healthy is actually not to wash it as often. I've learned this trick. They actually say that you should only wash your hair like once a week. But I know a lot of people out there may have oily hair. And if you have oily hair, those natural oils that are coming out of your scalp are actually good for your hair. It keeps your hair shiny, it keeps your hair strong, it keeps your hair strengthened. But if you don't want the look of greasy, oily hair, which none of us normally want, then I definitely would say use a weightless hydration dry shampoo. So a lot of dry shampoos out there dry up your scalp as well. So the key to this is this is actually a hydrating dry shampoo. So while it gives the appearance of a drier scalp, it's actually still moisturizing and hydrating your scalp and your hair. And I love this because it smells bomb and has rose water in it. You guys know I'm rose water obsessed. Can we get a boomerang made out of that? Like, I'm a human gift. All right, well, speaking of rose water products, you guys know I'm obsessed with rose water on so many levels. Guys, this is the Glossier Soothing Face Myths, and it actually is a rose water spray. Keep this in the fridge, people. Put this in the fridge. It's super cooling to your face. So it says soothing, but it'll be cooling as well. Mina's gonna hate this, but it's gonna be amazing. Oh, yes. I feel like you can use this whether you're wearing makeup or not wearing makeup. It even can set your makeup because we don't want to look powdery during the summer. You want to look dewy, you want to look fresh, you want to look youthful. 
and I know a lot of people end their makeup tutorials by using a setting spray. This is more like a dewy spray. And I love it because again, it is cooling, especially if you put it in the fridge, and it's a soothing face mist. I'm trying to see what else. It's just got rose water. That's it, just rose water. I absolutely love this. Other kind of rose water you can keep in your fridge. I know you guys saw it in my tour of my fridge, but it's actual H2 rose water, which you guys already know I'm obsessed with, but it actually has the same effect as the face mist, except for you're like hydrating the inside of your body. So rose water all around. Rose water for your hair, rose water for your face, rose water for the inside of your body. Okay, now getting to the body, the actual body and how we are going to look glistening and bronzy and sun-kissed. Some of my favorite products, you can get these at your drugstore. Jerkins Natural Glow. Can we get an applause? All right. Shout out to my girl Amber who actually put me onto this. She pretty much told me about it because we were on vacation in Italy last summer and she was using it there and she loved it for her body because it actually builds a tan as you go along and I know that I'm so not a fan of self tanners just not a fan of them. I think they smell weird. I think they get streaky, but this does not. It says it reduces the appearance of cellulite in as little as seven days. What woman does not want that? And this is the medium to tan skin tone. Lana uses this on a daily basis, not on herself, but we actually moisturize my legs before walking out on the reel every day. And this is what we use and we build a gradual tan. We should probably see if our hands are turning colors. Lana, did your hands turn colors using this? Do your hands turn a different color when you use the Jergens? They do? Okay, so your hands might turn color, so wash it after every time you use it, so that's the key. This is a great drugstore product. You guys know I like to show you high and low. This is super affordable, and I swear that it actually works, and my legs stay nice and tan. Thank you very much. Do I have something on my foot? Now, if you've used this and you don't see as much result as you want to see, then I say let's take it a step further and let's move on to another great drugstore product, which is Sally Hansen Airbrush Legs. This stuff really works. It will transform your race, literally. Like, you will look like you just came back from an amazing vacation in the Caribbean. I will show you guys kind of how this works on your arms. We use this so much for photo shoots, especially. You gotta be careful with it in real life because you don't want to get it on your clothes and you certainly don't want to hug somebody and get it on them. So I love this for like good photo shoots, but it's great for your legs as well. I wouldn't so much use it up here, which we do for photo shoots. Check it out. I recommend like spraying it like so, like this. And if you feel like it's gotten a little streaky, get a huge kabuki brush like this and just blend that in like so. Oh guys, this looks so good. Did I see this? I mean, look how white I was here. Look, get under there. You also can kind of do body contouring with this. So if you guys wanna make your arms look slimmer, go darker under here. I'm always trying to find ways to make my arms look slimmer. Don't forget your hands. This stuff is amazing. This is the perfect way to fake a tan during the summer without getting any of those harmful UV rays. And again, super affordable. Sally Hansen airbrush legs. Guys, your legs will look amazing with this stuff. It literally looks like, almost like blur foundation, but for your legs. Obsessed. I know I've talked about this before, but this is the original OG of body makeup, and it's originally by Scott Barnes. A lot of people have done versions of this, but this is the original people, and it is Body Bling Platinum. It's a moisturizing shimmer lotion that I use more so as a highlight, so it looks like this. So see, it's like a highlighter. So you don't necessarily wanna use this all over. I would use it on the places that you wanna highlight, like your shoulders. And that'll give like the perfect glow. Collarbone. You guys can even use this in your makeup. Like if you wanna dab it. It is a metallic shoulder. Speaking of great things to use on your body during the summer, you guys, let's not forget about like the essentials. What is this a tattoo? Okay. Let's not forget about the summer essentials, such as the simple things like deodorant. Guys, I'm weird. I like to use deodorant as a multi-purpose beauty item. So I've even had friends that if they can only pack one item, they would take like a Dove deodorant spray. And I have had friends that have used it as their dry shampoo. Come on, you guys, it gets hot during the summer. No one wants to be hot and be around people who are funky. Don't be funky in the summertime. Stay fresh. I personally love this cucumber scent from Dove. It's my fave. 
It gives me all the tropical vibes. And at the same time, guys, I even use this when I'm wearing undergarments that are like restricting, such as Spanx, and I will spray the inside lining of my Spanx with this deodorant, and I love it. I feel like it doesn't make you sticky. If we're honest, I've got thick thighs. They will stick together during the summertime. So spray a little bit of this between your thighs. You're good to go. Some more essentials for the summer. Things that we don't like to talk about, but we're keeping it real. Hello, you need some off spray. There is nothing like having mosquito bites all over your body. You look like you suffer from the chicken pox. So, and I'm a scratcher. Is anyone else here allergic to mosquitoes? I'm allergic to mosquito bites, so they end up being like huge welts that look like islands on my body. So not cute and painful and just not fun on so many levels when they keep you up at night and you're just scratching. I personally like using a mosquito repellent that isn't too intense, too strong, smells great. So I like to go with the off family care. So technically this is like kid friendly and you can use it on your kids. It's great for the whole family. That makes me feel better. It makes me feel like there aren't chemicals in this that'll like take me out. I'm just trying to take out the mosquitoes, not myself. So I like that and it's got a tropical fresh scent. As tropical as a mosquito repellent can get. So I travel with this for sure. Again, I also love getting travel safe bottles so that if you don't wanna check a bag, you guys know I hate checking a bag, you can put this in a smaller container so that you can carry it on board with you. This works, you'll be safe. Another way to be safe is from the sun. Mosquitoes aren't the only thing attacking us, so are the UV rays. So my favorite is the Super Goop Glow Stick and the Super Goop Sunscreen Mousse SPF 50. Now what I love about these is they don't have that white crazy look. That's the worst thing ever is for you to be like, oh, I'm protected from the sun, but I look insane. Guys, I literally could use this all over my entire face and you would never know it. It also goes really well under makeup because sometimes um, if you use a sunscreen or a sunblock under your makeup, it turns your makeup weird different colors. This does not do that. I'm gonna see it delivers glow boosting hydration and broad spectrum UV protection on the go. Amazonian oils restore balance for healthy radiant skin. Boom. So I love this stuff, it really works. This is great for my body, this is great for my face. All right, so this is the mousse. You're just gonna put it in like that. Guys, boom, that's it. That's insane for SPF 50 broad spectrum. I have never seen anything that goes on like this. It doesn't feel like SPF, it feels amazing and moisturizing. And I actually heard a lot of beauty bloggers talk about it, and that's why I got it. Another thing that is super important is to make sure that you exfoliate during the summer. So a lot of us have dead skin from the winter that we've carried on into the summer and that stops our skin from glowing, especially if you do wanna get a little bit of sun. I don't think there's anything wrong with getting a little bit of sun. Again, you wanna protect your skin. I know that I love a great suntan during the summer, so I'm not telling you guys to like sit under umbrellas all summer long. But a key to getting a great suntan is to make sure that you exfoliate prior to sun tanning so that your tan is completely even. And one of my favorite ways to do that is with a body polish. This one's my favorite, it's by Fresh. It smells like heaven, my husband's obsessed with it. And I actually just keep this in my shower all year round, but it especially comes in handy when I'm prepping for a great summer trip. Ooh, and it's even got ginseng root extract and peppermint to invigorate the senses and revitalize the skin cells. Bam, my skin cells are ready. We've got our feet exposed in the summertime. Nobody wants to see ashy feet. You wanna keep your feet moisturized. You don't wanna look like you have socks on, but you don't. Get a pedicure before you go on vacation. Super important, try a fun, funky polish color, all that good stuff. But most importantly, keep your feet moisturized. I actually found out about this product on The Real. This is actually a product made by Oprah's pedicurist. You know if Oprah uses it, it's good stuff. And this is the rose scent, you guys. It has like a cooling effect, the cream. First of all, it smells bomb. They also have it in different flavors. It comes in like eucalyptus, peppermint, um, lavender. Lavender is the other scent. It's got like a cooling feel to it. So I even feel like if you wore a pair of high heels that hurt your feet, put this on, put some socks on at night over it. Woo, woo sa, your feet will feel brand new in the morning. Okay, I didn't even tell you guys what it's called. It's called Foot Nanny. Foot Nanny Foot Cream, and this is the rose scent. Don't be ashy this summer. Now on to one of my favorite parts of the summer, and it is summer beauty, summer makeup. Now, the foundation for great makeup, for me always, is hydration and a great moisturizer, so my current favorite for the summer 
is the Glossier Bubble Wrap, and it is an eye and lip plumping cream, but honestly, I use it all over my face. So it's specifically supposed to be like for your delicate under eye areas, and it's supposed to like plump it and make it just look juicy and refreshed and youthful. Well guys, I use it for my whole face, and I actually really do use it under my lips as well. So I love this. One of my favorites, I, oh gosh, I love the Glossier packaging. How cute is that? And again, this is travel size. So that's perfect for my summer vacations. Once you're done moisturizing, the next step for me is a little bit of foundation. Now I like to be sparing with the foundation, especially during the summer. You wanna keep your skin fresh and glowy, but I'm kind of obsessed with this drugstore favorite, which is ELF Flawless Finish Foundation. Now you guys, they came out with 40 different shades that I'm obsessed with. So what I love about that is on vacation, I usually bring more than one foundation because I may have arrived one color, but baby, I'm leaving another. So I love that they have so many different shade options. Uh, I probably would start at Nude, is my light medium with pink peachy undertones, and I will be leaving medium. You don't have to use, of course, my Trusted Beauty Blender, somebody cue in Israel's voice. I love this blender. So I always like to dab like this, and again, I'm only gonna use it in the places that I might really need it. Like, if you have a blemish, you just use that to just blend that in like so. Brighten up your under eyes a little bit. And I like that it's not a concealer, it's a foundation, which is a lot lighter, it's not heavy. And I'll use instead this as like my concealer for summertime, because it won't be heavy. So I'll do a little bit under my eyes. Another cool thing that's a great idea is if you want to do more of like a tinted moisturizer, you actually can blend this with your moisturizer. Like I would blend this with the bubble wrap, with the Glossier bubble wrap, mix it together, put it on like face lotion, it'll almost look like a blur. Voila. Feeling good, feeling great. Once you're done with your foundation, you're gonna wanna do simple things like highlight, which is my favorite thing, clearly, and I'm obsessed with this hourglass highlighter. I like it for multiple reasons. First of all, can we just see how this goes on, the packaging again, amazing. But look how that goes on. That is, that is a strong highlighter right there, which I love because during the summertime, you kind of wanna highlight in the areas that you naturally would get glowy in, your forehead, right over here. Yes, oh, oh, hello. Yes, highlight come through. I also like to do my Cupid's bow. Another great place to highlight is the tip of your nose. For me, it just makes my nose look a lot shorter. So I like to just go in like this. Voila. I like to create a very natural, juicy lip for summertime. I like the look of like, oh, I don't have lipstick on. Oh, but yes, I do. And you can create that look with some of these products that I'm about to show you. My personal favorites right now are they just extended the KKW Beauty Nude Lip Palette. This is two and a half. I know before it was like one, two, three, four. Now she's got a two and a half. And this is the two and a half nude, which is my favorite one right now. That's what I have on. I actually like to start by moisturizing my lips. Again, this is Bubble Wrap is a lip plumping cream, so you actually can massage it over your lips like that, which is what I did. Massaged it over my lips. After I massaged the bubble wrap over my lips, then I used the KKW Beauty 2.5 Nude Lip Liner to excessively outline my lips to make them extra juicy and extra big. Going under and filling in a little bit. Totally freaking like my lips are this big when they're not. And then once you're done with that, then you are going to apply the lipstick. Again, this is 2.5 Nude by KKW Beauty. That's beautiful. Oh my God, it almost looks like a sandy, like Samoan sands, like yes. I don't even know what that means, but it sounds really pretty. Oh, I love that. And then we are gonna top it with Patrick Ta's new lip glosses, you guys. This one is Major Glow Lip Shine, and this is in the color, is she younger than me? <gasps> the devastation. This is everything. Like, this has like all the shimmer in it, but I hate lip glosses that are shimmery and you can feel the glitter, like. <sighs> this is not that. This totally feels smooth and moisturizing. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed my favorite summer beauty products. Let me know what some of yours are in the comments below. And don't forget that you can actually check out all of these products listed below in the description. Go snatch them, they're bomb. Let me know what you think when you try them. Love you guys, Mwah. Don't forget to subscribe.